Breaking news tonight, Supervisor Nathan Fletcher says he will resign from the Board of Supervisors at the end of his medical leave. Thanks for joining us. I'm Carlo Chiquetta. I'm Marcella Lee. This new development comes as a new lawsuit accuses him of sexual assault and harassment. The woman accusing him is a former San Diego Metropolitan Transit System worker. CBS 8's Jesse Pagan is here continuing our coverage. Jesse? Yeah, Carlo Marcella, Supervisor Fletcher made the announcement just minutes ago on Twitter and through his spokesperson. We want to show you some of those tweets. It, they begin with this one. The strain on my wife and family over this past week has been immense and unbearable. A combination of my personal mistakes plus false accusations has created a burden that my family shouldn't have to bear. I will be resigning from the Board of Supervisors effective. Supervisor Fletcher went on to say at the end of my medical leave, that's when the resigning will happen. He says he'll focus solely on getting healthy and being a good husband, father, and friend. I am grateful to my constituents for the honor of serving you, my incredible team who worked tirelessly to make a real difference. He also says in our county workers, he's grateful for them as well, who put it all on the line for those most in need every day. I am proud of what we accomplished together. My decision today is solely based on what is best for my family. In an accompanying tweet, his wife, Lorena Gonzalez, said that she asked him to make the resignations. The 26-page lawsuit filed with the Superior Court of California in San Diego County names the plaintiff as Grecia Figueroa. Because of that, CBS 8 is naming her. The lawsuit claims Fletcher started flirting with Figueroa in February 2022 by sending private messages on Instagram, saying things like, quote, home alone, no wife and kids, and, quote, I have a closet, no one would see us there. According to the lawsuit, the two met in May of last year for a drink at a hotel where it claims he, quote, put his hands on her and kissed her. The claims say Figueroa insisted they stop and she went home. Figueroa worked as a public relations specialist for the San Diego Metropolitan Transit System. At the same time, Fletcher served as chair of the MTS board. The lawsuit describes another encounter in June of 2022 claiming Fletcher met with Figueroa in a conference room after an MTS committee meeting and, quote, put his mouth against hers, began to grab her breasts through her clothes. Ms. Figueroa pushed him back. The lawsuit claims Fletcher sexually assaulted Figueroa a second time in December 2022, quote, grabbing her breasts underneath her blouse and pulling off some of her clothes. In a statement, Fletcher's attorney says in part, quote, the allegations are false and are designed to drive headlines and not tell the truth. The simple truth is that Ms. Figueroa pursued my client. Their interactions were consensual and Mr. Fletcher does not and never had authority over her employment. In a separate statement, Fletcher says in part, quote, I have not done the things they are alleging, but I did violate the basic trust and loyalty of my marriage and set a terrible example for our children. My wife has done nothing but love me completely and without reservation, and the blame for allowing myself to be in this situation rests entirely on my shoulders. Figueroa was fired from MTS last month. Her lawsuit also claims retaliation. An MTS spokesperson tells us an outside law firm is now investigating, and Fletcher has already resigned as board chair effective last night. For all breaking news and alerts and the latest developments on this story, follow us on social media at CBS 8. Head to CBS 8.com or download the CBS 8 app.